Uh, well, barbrico is about spuntini, which is small plates, as well as the uh, charcuterie. So in you know, Italian, it'd be salumi and formaggi. So we do all imported Italian meats, uh, cheeses. Uh, we do one in-house, which is the porchetta, which is a you know a pork, uh, almost a cooked pork uh, charcuterie style. Well, with the cured meats, I think you know the adage is always you know you should drink. What grows together, you should consume together. So the, the food and drink from a certain region tends to go together. So a lot of the cured meats uh, have origins within Emilia Romagna or the north. And so then you want to, you know, a good, good bet is always Lambrusco, uh, which is also from Emilia Romagna. So there's different varietals of um, uh, Lambrusco, but it's a sparkling red. Uh, just frizzante, not spumante, so just get a little bit of effervescence, uh, nice liveliness in the mouth. One thing that's always great with cured meats is you always think cured meats are very salty, very fatty, so you want something with high acidity. And that's where both Lambruscos that we have here uh, fit that to a T. So the, this Lambrusco would pair well with the mortadella, whereas uh, with the porchetta, the porchetta is very salty, very flavorful, uh, then you would want to do something which you know has a more tartness, uh, which is this other uh, style of Lambrusco, which is more of a rosé. So these are both the same varietal. They're both Lambrusco, Lambrusco Salamino. And so one, this is the the one that's you know the more traditional perhaps method. It's you know just slightly frizzante. You can just st see still a little bit of the the bubble, but it's just going to be lively in the mouth. But more you know dark berry notes, raspberry notes, nice acidity but you know, very kind of comfortable wine. And then this wine is exactly the same varietal, but done in a, you know, the traditional champagne style where the secondary fermentation happens in the bottle. Uh, and it's all done with natural yeasts, uh, l much less skin contact, so you're getting uh, a much lighter color. But also this one, uh, even though it's the same varietal, you're getting uh, much more of a, a tart, slightly bitter, extremely dry uh, wine.